Hey guys, it's Vios, and here we have today released DLC weapons for the black market. They include the Peacekeeper Mark II, the Nunchucks, the DBSR Sniper Rifle, the R70 Ajax LMG, and a Shock Patan. And also we have Specialist Taunts and Gestures, and um, I'm going to be talking about each of them. So if you guys enjoy this video, please leave a thumbs up, and if you want to see more content like this, please subscribe to me, and let's get into it. Now first up, we have the Peacekeeper Mark II. If um, any of you remember, the Peacekeeper was the first DLC weapon and it was released back in Black Ops 2 for the first DLC map pack. And um, they brought it back in Black Ops 3 obviously and they've called it the Peacekeeper Mark II, so it's the second version of it. And um, yeah, it's pretty much a, all back in Black Ops 2 was a SMG assault rifle hybrid. It was a hybrid assault rifle hybrid. I'm pretty sure it was called, and um, it was pretty much at close distances. It was okay, and then when it got to that medium to long range, it was probably the best assault rifle for medium distance because it acted like an SMG. But when it came to those medium distance, it was just flat out perfect. But um, yeah, that's been the peacekeeper. And now, the nunchucks, it's pretty much explains themselves. The nunchucks, you run around the map crazily, swinging nunchucks, hitting people with them. But yeah, from you can see from the trailer, it's a pretty, pretty awesome weapon to use. Now, moving on to the DBSR 50 double barrel sniper rifle. Now, this gun, if you played Black Ops 2, you would instantly think dbsr 50 as the DSR 50. Um, so, yeah, pretty much it's a double barrel shotgun. So, what you do, you would Put your ammo in it, cock it, and you could shoot. But instead of doing that reloading animation for the next, like as another burst rifle in the other, in this game, it you've got one more bullet. So when you shoot, you can shoot again, and then it does the reloading. So that's pretty unique. So you, hopefully you can get some um, pretty good feed with that. Now for a very peculiar gun to show up in Black Ops 3, we've got the R70 Ajax LMG, which is pretty much something you would see from either Advanced Warfare or um, saying that you would see in Infinite Warfare when it comes out, but this gun would have to remind me of, I think it was the EM1, EM1, that, um, laser LMG, but yeah, it's just, it's got bullets instead, and it, once, if you, just like, acts like any, um, other unlimited gun, once you shoot too much, it will overheat, so if you can control that, and control your ammo, you could just, keep going on and on and on get fees chain kills all this magnificent stuff but yeah all you gotta do is watch that ammo but yeah so uh, pretty um weird to see in black ops 3 and you would usually see that in an in advanced warfare or maybe infinite warfare we'll see for the last of the weapons this is a melee weapon again this is a shock baton um it's pretty much a stick and it's got electricity on it, so when you touch someone with it, it electrifies them. So, you know, saying you would see in some sort of enforcer, so futuristic cop show or something. But, um, yeah, a lot of um, movies in the future, you would see this. Uh, but, yeah, you'd pretty much just run around, hit people with them, shock them, and then they're down. But uh, that's about it for it. Now, this is saying I've always been wanting to see in Black Ops 3. I've been saying this to one of my friends all the time that I wish they would bring this in. And this is Specialist Taunts. So, as you can see on screen, it is a gesture that only your specialist can have. So, say, as you saw, you've got the gravity spikes where he throws them into the ground and they do that ripple effect. You've got the guy with the uh, Tempest. You've got, what's his name? Oh, I don't know his name. But he shoots them in the sky and then they come down as lightning bolts. I've always been wanting to see them and I just want to see all of them. Fucking, if I find the other seven or eight, if um, Blackjack has it, I don't think he does because he has nothing. But if I find the other seven, I will be sure to show you guys because this is just saying I've always wanted to see and I thought it would be really unique to specialist character. So, yeah. So, that has been the it for the review of the... July DLC weapons, I guess you can call them, because we've been pretty much getting them once every month, every second month, you know. But um, yeah, if you guys have enjoyed this video, smash those thumbs up, and if you want to see more content like this from me, please hit that subscribe button and uh, stay, stay in touch, stay active on the channel, and you know. Oh, and just a reminder, if you want to be part of the free shout out I'm giving at 100 subscribers, but only one person will get it. And if you, you got to be the first. 
100 subscribers to get this. So, um, yeah, that'll be it. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in the uh, next video.